hey guys welcome back to another exciting video where we will be unboxing the purchases that i made via Savo store they are in this huge ass box right here and before we get into cutting it open seeing what's inside i just wanted to talk about my shopping experience with Savo store this time round in my last video i mentioned that the customer service was great and it is great they're very friendly and very helpful and eager to answer any questions that you may have but the thing with the customer service is that sometimes it could be very unreliable I've had times when I've called them after 4 p.m. and they wouldn't pick up despite it being indicated on the site that the customer service line is open from 8 to 5. Maybe, you know, sometimes at 4 or Kwanzaa 4, you know, you're not in the office or maybe the work just wasn't that much. But then like, now, like for a service like this one, you know, you can get so many questions as a customer. I remember personally before before buying i was having so much hesitation because i wanted to make a black friday purchase and usually with these websites they usually give you a discount code so so because i was using the buy and ship service where Savo store would do the buying for me i wasn't really sure if they would remember to put in the code so that's a question that i desperately needed answered before i could buy my products i tried calling them but now i called very late even me i should have planned to do it early in the day i asked them the next day and they replied that yes they'll make the purchase for me but with the original product amount let's say if the product is 30 usd on sale it would probably be at 12 usd depending on the site and on the discount code you have i knew it would be on sale at 12 usd and i knew the sale runs till december the 4th but now it's november 22nd and i'm contacting them asking them about it they need to take till uh, november 23rd maybe in the evening to get back to me because now i had asked that question via email and wanted a clarification on phone but they were not available that day so i had to wait for a reply the next day which i got afterwards you need now to make an invoice query where you send in the products that you want bought that's the product name the price and then the link to the product and then now that one they can take so long before they get back to you i made three purchases so i have two purchases here with me for the third purchase they got back to me like five days after i had made that invoice query by the time they had gotten back to me i kind of missed the ship date like they usually say make sure your products are in our office by the 4th of december but now this other purchase they made it so late such that it got to their office a day after they had shipped out the rest of the packages such as this one i guess even if that particular site had said that the sale only runs from such and such a date and Savo store hadn't gotten back to me by that date i'd have missed out on that sale so to avoid such a thing you as the consumer you'd probably need to make such an early invoice so that that both sides can be happy so now because they told me to just send the full amount to make a black friday purchase i was also more hesitant because you know you're basically telling me to spend more money which i did not want to spend but then now when they sent back the money i just got like a surprise and pesa message i didn't really get a breakdown of this is why you have received x amount of money we bought product one at five usd instead of 10 usd like i kind of expected a receipt basically so i contacted them again and asked for proof of you know the purchase to see how much they spent and they sent that to me i think i should just take some time to understand why certain amount of fees is being charged for shipping and why it's being charged so now like for this these are two separate sites that's amazon.com and sokoglam.com sokoglam is a korean skincare website so they packed all the items together in a huge 
box to save me space but still i don't understand why or how much space i've saved i don't understand because i did pay shipping fees for separate so you know you see like i need to take some time to understand this whole online shopping thing enough talking let's get to opening the box i'll start with the small box first fun fact about Soko Glam is that it was started by Charlotte Cho. She's a skin esthetician. She's Korean American, so she saw the gap in the American market where women didn't really have quality products. Now, seeing she's Korea, she had the experience, she had the knowledge, she had seen how skincare in her culture was emphasized. So she created Soko Glam, an American website that sells Korean stuff. So she Charlotte is credited with bringing the skincare knowledge to the US and like to the Western world. So these are my Soko Glam purchases. I bought three Tony Moly Super Peeling Liquid Shiny Foot. Like they are some exfoliating what pads for your feet. I hear that when you apply these peeling liquids, you can't wear open shoes for like the next week because your legs will be peeling. The liquid inside them and then wear them. I had to buy moisturizer to replace the one that I had. Claire's Rich Moist Soothing Cream. I also have my snail mucin, of course. Let me even just take it out of the... Oh, it looks different. Oh, they changed the cup. The other one wasn't looking like this. Oh, yeah. This is one purchase that I was so excited for. And that's the Kosar X Acne Pimple Master Patch. Apparently, when you use this thing on a pimple, the next morning you wake up without it. They are round patches in different sizes and what they do is that they just suck out the gunk and pass out of the pimple so next day you wake up and the thing is dry there are 24 of them you can get this locally at korean products in kenya next is my first oil cleanser the clean it zero balm by vanilla co wow that packaging looks stunning next I bought this specifically for my mom, but I'll also use this and that's the anti-aging midnight blue calming cream. It is specifically used at night time. It has some restorative abilities on the skin. We'll dive deeper into it in a separate video. And then I also bought this new toner that I want to try and that is the Aquel Licorice pH Balancing cleansing toner it was one of the most popular toners on the site i think it won like toner of the year last year or something so i was just curious to find out about this product next we have wow i bought a cleanser i bought this cleanser why did i buy this cleanser i think i bought this cleanser for my mom but i also want to try and use it the claire's rich moist foaming cleanser now that it's here i wonder why i bought it though oh but i remember shopping and thinking okay my cleanser is running out so thank you past kish and then the last final thing and this is the biopeptide fermentation eye cream swani coco i remember spotting it on a site where it was being recommended for anti-aging especially for mature skin 50s and above so i bought this for my mom we are on to my amazon purchases now and as i open this box all i can smell is either eucalyptus or lemon and that's because i bought essential oils i don't know if they are broken i don't know if that angle is the best but so i'll take out these um air bags i don't remember the specific reason for putting them in the package so these are yeah these are ring lights that i bought string lights 12 packs oh they have batteries 
Oh, so these bunches and these different of them. Okay, that's interesting. So you can take one out and let's see. Wow. It's lit. It is lit, people. Wow, it looks lovely. I also bought this selfie ring light, which I think will be very useful for filming at night or just taking selfies. <laughs> Vanity. So. Okay. Oh. <laughs> We are new to these things, guys. And then now you'll just be doing this, putting it on your phone, locking, and then it's no batteries. Sadly, I don't have any batteries for now. And on that note, let's just um, talk about this ring light that I got because it's about time. I should show you the way I am filming right now. Let's just say this thing will come in very handy. I'm also feeling kind of like Casey Neistat right now. You know the way Casey used to have those unboxing videos. I don't really feel like getting into switching this on and finding out what goes where right now this is the tripod the light it's a 10 inch ring light then next is oh a portable fan i've been really curious to see how this works so let me just take it out real quick wow there it is and it is chargeable and then I have this thing to just put it around my neck wow perfect oh my god it looks so good and feels good too <gasps> I'm changing the speeds right now wow I feel like I'm shamba perfect off and then Oh, these are candles. Yeah, they are. They're just mini candles that I got for my room. Okay, how are these opened? I want to tell you the flavors. Okay, the flavors are coconut, banana, lilac, strawberry, melon, and himalayan sea salt these candles are really super mini but i don't mind them because i didn't want them for a big space anyway but i wonder what i'll put in these jars once this is over maybe shots these will be my short glasses now in my house i also bought this bluetooth speaker we'll test that out also later stick it off champagne color package the packaging can give you such a bad cut wow it's so tiny okay it's tinier than i expected but look okay the charging port it's beeping i think of somebody of my needs this will be enough i'm using my phone for filming so i can't quite test it right now next these are the essential oils. <gasps> they spilled. Eucalyptus. I was right. <laughs> eucalyptus is the one that was leaking. There's eucalyptus, there's sweet orange, tea tree, peppermint, lemongrass, lavender. Oh man, I feel so disappointed. <laughs> this whole thing is just wet. This is also wet. Next, I bought these backgrounds for Instagram. These are for my product, flat lays. Like, I'll just line this up on the floor, on the table, put my products on there, and then take the beautiful pictures. Hopefully, now I'll be getting psych to post. Oh, I feel like an artist. Taking out my paintings. Oh, so these two of them. 
no not two of them it's just two sided there is this marble side and then this other side and then i can already guess what this is and that is a humidifier which i am trying out for the first time this just says one year warranty honestly i love a nice smelling house and hopefully this will help me achieve that and this is a white one i was expecting a blue one but i don't mind this color lastly is this huge tippy tent that i bought for my niece supposed to look like this so hopefully we'll have a lot of fun with that Ooh, so after that hectic unboxing all we can do is just cool down i think this is my favorite purchase of them <laughs> oh god here i go breaking it already by the one thing that i forgot to mention about the site is that you can only give them an invoice of 10 items or below so for this order i had to make three separate orders so that's the only thing i had to point out i'll try and list all the items down in the description box so you can go getting more info on them if you like i'll see you in my next video thank you so much for tuning in it's bye from me and good night